just act natural, man. Pretend I'm not even here. You don't even see me, partner. Window, do you mind? I'm trying to put this ceiling fan together. Man, that's boring. Do something funny, like get struck by lightning so you can get that buckwheat look. <laughs> this might be a stupid question, but why would I do that? So I can win $10,000 on America's Funniest Home Videos, man. <laughs> oh, in that case, pass me the lightning rod. You do that funny man? No. <laughs> Maybe something funny's going down in the living room. CC, I'm gonna say something funny to make you laugh, and you take a drink of that, and the milk gonna come shooting out your nose. That sounds interesting. Mommy! I'll do it. Oh, man. I knew I could count on you, little buddy. I can smell the money. $10,000. Window, help! Window! Just what you do, man. Get my camera. Window! Window! $10,000! $10,000! Window! 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 Oh, man! Uh, Are you okay, Rob? Uh, ah, come on. Ah, you okay? I think so. All right. Okay, get back up there. Just take two, all right? Action! Action! Uh, let me try. Try. Voila. That was amazing. How did you do that? Uh, easy. It's my locker. <laughs> uh, oh, okay. This is yours. There you go. Thanks. Uh, so we're neighbors. I'm Michael. I'm Chantel. How you doing? I'm usually not this stupid. Hey, these lockers can be pretty tricky. It can happen to anyone. <laughs> this is Ira. He's our valedictorian. I think I'm going to do well in this school. <laughs> um, I gotta go find my math class. Okay, so... I guess I'll see you around. Okay, I'll see you around then. Okay. Uh, wait, 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 Chantel, Chantel. Um, there is a free concert on Saturday in Central Park. You wanna go? I'd love to. But I have to watch my baby brother. Why, does he do something special? <laughs> <laughs> No, no, it's just cool. Just bring him along. Bring him along. Really? Yeah, totally. Are you sure? Perfect, perfect. Yeah, so um, I'll pick you up on Saturday. Can we uh, meet at your house? Oh, yeah, that, that would even be more perfect. Okay, yeah, so I'll see you on Saturday then. Okay. Okay. All right. All right. <laughs> Yo, Romeo, you blew it, man. Well, I blew it. What are you talking about, man? Not only do I have a date with her, but she's picking me up. Really? Does she know where you live? <laughs> Chantel! <laughs> What are you doing here? You sound just like my old man. 
Listen, I'm sorry, man, but I was expecting Chantel. <laughs> Me too. I just want to see what it's like when a girl actually shows up. I rig it out. Man, now you really sound like my old man. Please, though, I just want to watch. I right, will just watch from up there. Come on, come on. Chantel. Hi. 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 Hey, Chantel. Hi, Ira. Hey. Who do we have here? Hello. Hi, Jay. How you doing, man? Hi. Hi, how you doing? I think Jay really likes you. Well, you know, on the street, I'm known as the pacifier. <laughs> <laughs> I'm taking notes, dog. Uh, I think this might be a good time for us to get going. OK. <laughs> I hope you like reggae, baby Jay. Oh, he loves it. He'll probably get dreads as soon as he gets some hair. <laughs> mm -hmm. Smooth. <laughs> Guess who? Mm. Wendell. Wendell? You could at least say Denzel. <laughs> now, Wendell's outside taping us. Man, why'd you stop? I almost had something. So did I. <laughs> Wendell's got this crazy scheme about winning that money from America's Funniest Home Videos. Oh. I need that money so I can move. I mean, my building's been broken in twice this month. Well, Wendell, if you're so worried about security, why don't you get a dog or something? My neighbor had a dog. Somebody stole him. <laughs> Come on, guys, think of what I can do with that money. $10,000? <laughs> hmm. And this week's $10,000 winner is America's favorite substitute teacher, Wendell Wilcox. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Robin, Jared, this is a little payback for all you done for <laughs> Bring it in. You moving in here? Yeah, it's a shorter walk to dinner. Robin, Jerry, first thing I'm gonna do is put some real art on the wall. What is that, a Picasso? Get out of here. <laughs> yeah. That's more like Come on, Rob, man. They're not gonna pay me for a video of you daydreaming, man. You can't force these things, okay? Now, you know, the funniest videos are the ones you stumble upon spontaneously. Yeah, right. Like, that's gonna happen, man. Thanks a lot, partners. <laughs> Hey, Wendell, what up? Nothing much, man. Just looking for something to videotape. Anything stupid and ridiculous happen around here? Uh, nope. Too bad. Stay black, man. <laughs> This has been the best two weeks of my life. I feel the same way. Yeah, it's nice to finally have some privacy. Yeah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> hey, dog. Ira, man. How's the neck? Yo, still pretty stiff. Yeah. <laughs> oh, sorry, Vince. <laughs> Michael, I'm sorry I have to talk to you. Lisa, what are you doing? You have to tell him. I can't. Look, if you don't, I will. Now well, tell him. Will somebody just please tell me? Okay, look, Michael. I don't know if it's true or not, but Teresa heard that Chantel's baby brother is really her son. Congratulations. The both of you have hit a new low. I told you not to tell him. <laughs> Chantel, you're going to love this one. Michael. Oh, no. Oh, hey, hey, hey. Uh, uh, no. No. You put out a rumor, you're going to have to stand by it, all right? Chantel, check this out. The word from the mouth patrol <laughs> is that, you know, your little baby brother Jay, right, is really your son. <laughs> you're not laughing. Michael. It's true. Ma 
Mike, I'm sorry. I hate it. I'm not talking to you, Zarya. Mom, Dad, will you please tell your daughter that from now on she should mind her own business? And tell your son that instead of yelling at me, he should decide what he's gonna do about that baby. Let's skip right past the clues and go straight to the answer. <laughs> and the answer better be, it's not your baby. It's not my baby. Well, that's Good the thing, answer. Yeah. <laughs> I just found out that Chantel's little baby brother, Jay, is really her son. I'm sorry to hear that, Michael. Michael, have you and Chantel talked about this? Yeah, she told me the whole story, how she met this guy and mm -hmm. fell in love, or she thought she fell in love with him, and she ends up pregnant. He takes off, and she changes schools to start a new life. Unfortunately, that's a pretty common story. I don't understand how anybody could walk away from Chantel and a cute little kid like Jay. I don't know, but... Too many do. Yeah, well, not me. Michael, that baby is not your responsibility. It doesn't matter. I mean, I care about Chantel and Jay, and I just want to be there for them. Son, you're 16 years old. How there are you going to be? I don't know, but I want to be a part of their lives. <laughs> Are you sure you don't mind babysitting? Oh, no, no problem. Just next time I change his diapers, I'll be wearing goggles. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what's that for? You're incredible. I don't know uh, many guys who'd hang in there with me. Oh, well, let's see. There's, uh, there's me and maybe a couple of guys from the Bible. <laughs> <laughs> I, uh, I gotta go. <clears throat> be good. I'll yeah. be back in an hour. Okay. Bad, 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 bad. What's up, Chantel? Hey, I don't Hey, oh, dog. <laughs> hey, puppy. Bad, <laughs> Did you hear what he just said? Just call me daddy. Uh, y'all think he just called you gravy. <laughs> Maybe he's hungry. No, he called me daddy. Didn't you call me daddy? <laughs> Yo, maybe I'm hungry. Hey, you got any gravy? <laughs> oh, I know where babies come from. You do? Yeah, that fiddle. <laughs> She find out before me. <laughs> hey, Chantel. I'm sorry I'm late. Oh, no problem, hon. You will never guess what Baby J did. He called me daddy. Michael, how do I tell you this? I was gravy, huh? <laughs> the reason I asked you to watch Baby J is because his father wanted to see me. And... Uh, don't you two have something to do? Nope. <laughs> well, find something. Right? And I better not catch you listening at the door. Oh, man, there goes plan B. <laughs> so this guy shows up after six months, huh? What does he want? Is he giving you a bad time? He wanted to apologize. <sighs> you know, I, don't, I don't even think that's good enough. You know, did he, did he say anything about supporting you or being a real father to his son? Yeah, he did. <laughs> what a jerk, man. <laughs> Mike, he wants to do the right thing. So, uh, that's what he's saying. Are you saying you love him? Well, I thought I loved him. Until he left. And then I thought I'd never forgive him. And now he's back, and I don't know what to think. But we have a child together. And I need to see if we can really be a family. 
He's not a bad guy, Michael. I want you to meet him. I really don't think that's a good idea. Tony! Hey, man, I'm flexible. <laughs> Tony, this is my friend Michael. Hey, what's up? What's up? Yeah, Chantel says you've been, you know, real nice to her and our son. Yeah, that's it's me, Mr. Nice Guy. <laughs> This is your son. Before you take him, you should know that he likes peekaboo and uh, reggae music and smelling my brother's sneakers. <laughs> he discovered that one on his own. I remember that, man. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> hey. <laughs> hey, son. It's daddy. Oh. Look, I got a job, you know, and, and I'm going to school at night. Oh, I'm going to do right by you and your mom. Michael, I hope you understand. I do. Mama. Hey, Chantel, I think he just said daddy. Nah, it's gravy. <laughs> Says it all the time. I'll never forget what you did for us. watch this video show. Ever since they broke into my house and stole my camera. Too bad there's no show called America's Worst Love. <laughs> You're lucky you weren't home when they broke in. Let me tell you something, they lucky, because I would have broke them down and broke them, and broke them, and broke them down. That's right. This next video would have been a sure contender for the $10,000 prize, but it was sent in anonymously. Evidently, they didn't care about the money. They just wanted you to see it. Nah, man, that's, nah, that's no. <laughs> Window, those crooks are taping you with your own camera. off Van Winkle. <laughs> Thank you, you've been too kind. Oh, Wendell, you. you said you weren't home when they robbed you. Did I say home? I'm in a week. <laughs> Man, I'm sorry they got away with all your stuff. That's okay. Everything was insured. Except for that camera and that watch I borrowed from you. Look, I gotta go, guys. <laughs> Son, uh, you can't drown your problems in cocoa. Uh, I'm sorry, I just... I miss Chantel and Baby J. You know, I'm... I'm never gonna open myself up like that again. You just... you just get hurt. You're right. Never show people that you care. Never put yourself out for another human being. And I guarantee you, you'll never get hurt again. You're making a point, right, Dad? 
And I think you know what it is. If you had to do it all over again, would you? In a heartbeat. Give it a while. They don't all end up like this. You know, he really did call me daddy. You know, when you were his age, you used to call me gravy. <laughs> I did. Really? Gra gravy. <laughs> gravy. He's so cute! Look at him! Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, no! Get out of here! Get out of here! No! 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 Run! Run! Get out of here! Save yourselves! Ricky, Dicky, get off me! Ricky. 